Hi, and welcome back to another hacking tutorial from Stealth Data Zero. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install Metasploit on your Android device. So this will install Metasploit on your Android device using the app Termex. Again, Termex, T-E-R-M-U-X. You can download it from the Play Store. And it's a terminal emulator app, which allows you to run scripts and do other things like SSH. So... Metasploit obviously is a fundamental tool to hacking. Of course, it's not going to work the same as it would on a Linux or Ubuntu or Unix device, um, but it can produce uh, MSF Venom payloads, it can run exploits, and it can allow you to actually take over a device using just your Android phone and use a lot of the functions of Metasploit. Um, especially if you're a more advanced Termex user, you'll be able to learn workarounds to do a lot of things. So let's go ahead and get started. So obviously you want to have the app downloaded and then you would just hit. So first thing you want to do is um, upgrade it. So app install update. And PKG g install update make sure you run those two commands now i'm going to hit control c and stop this but then you want to install unstable repos so app install unstable repos make sure you enter that and then app install metasploit And that will begin the process of installing Metasploit. And it's a very useful tool. Again, Metasploit is the foundation for um, a lot of uh, pen testers, what they use to uh, do a lot of things from create malware to run exploits um, or all the way up to writing your own scripts, editing exploits and implementing them and using them. It gives you the um, interpreter shell, which is a powerful terminal that breaks down simple uh, commands and breaks them, breaks them down into simple commands. So it takes terminal commands, breaks them down into one line, two line commands that you can run and do a lot of useful things. So we'll go ahead and start Metasploit. You just type MSF console. And once everything is done for you, you'll be able to run Metasploit the same way. and it will give you an up-to-date version. Now you can use a VPN on your phone, GPS spoofing to make it a little bit more anonymous. Again, hacking with your phone, not recommended. You should always use a computer with a Linux, Ubuntu, or Unix type system. Um, Kali Linux is very popular, Parrot OS is very popular. It comes installed with these tools, but again, it is useful to use your Android device. Um, it's portable, it's small, it's uh, discreet. Um, and it could be very powerful in a lot of cases um, just using this device and having it in your pocket. And I often use it as a support tool alongside my computer. So I have my computer and I have my phone, maybe running a server, um, maybe running, you know, some kind of script or a Metasploit. Um, you could also get tools like Nmap and things like that and actually do a lot of hacking just with your phone. But again, a computer is recommended. And as you can see, we have the new version of Metasploit, and it's uh, pretty much fully functional, um, minus a few things. Um, again, if you're an advanced Termex user, you can find workarounds. Um, you can easily access your storage and stuff like that, so you can save pictures, the text files that you pull from phones, other files that you pull from computers. Um, you can upload, download files once you get a shell. Again, you can run scripts. Um, you can use the search command just like you would. And you can see all the, the scripts and exploits. Control C to quit. And again, the commands are 
you want to update it pkg install update um, app install update is the next command you want to run so app install update then you want to run app install unstable repos and then pkg or app install metasploit and that will install metasploit for you so hopefully you found the video informative if you did go ahead and drop a like subscribe for more content and as always have fun stay safe keep pen testing peace out